if people reckon like it's not that easy to see that that's it's it's easy just to turn on your computer click facebook or click google that's easy but to, to but to see how this whole process is working there has to be there has to be the explanation why do they have billions of dollars of profits where is it coming from it's got to be coming from somewhere they're not really making anything they're using everybody else's content that somebody else has made like you, you make your posts that you put on there you make all these stupid arguments you have with people that they keep throwing you at, at you know the mm, vox is good no vox is bad oh vox is good you're wrong i know this is the statistics look at this wormhole on youtube you know it, 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 back, back and forth but yay, hey, you're on here longer, we can serve you more ads and we can click more dough. Uh, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's not a healthy, w healthy way to be communicating when we're in an emergency. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's also interesting to think about as well. Um, people, like I know I have, I've had family members that are like so susceptible to those Facebook ads. And like, it's like, I just get like calls from like people in my family that are like, oh yeah, I bought this thing off of it. I bought this thing online and it hasn't come in yet. Or it's like, I got it. And it's like, you know, a miniature of what I thought it was. And I'm like, was it a Facebook ad? And they're like, yeah. And I'm like, don't click on those. I just, I'm trying to figure out like what it is that makes people so susceptible. Like, what is it about our society that we feel like we need those things like, that were being served on there well everyone has a weakness and and the the the, the platforms are designed to find it 